Hi guys, do you know what is the worst dating advice you can give to someone today? I have heard of this advice passed around like a thousand times, but I have always wondered why it's so widely used and accepted. In fact, I tried this advice for years myself and many a time they always ended up in ways I never wanted. But as soon as I stopped doing this, I began to experience and learn a lot more after every date. And the advice is called, just be yourself. Well, there is nothing wrong with being yourself if you're getting the relationships that you have always wanted. But it becomes a problem when you don't get the guy to call you again or the girl to return your text after the first date. Don't you think so? In that case, wouldn't it make more sense to just put this advice aside and really ask yourself, what is more to being myself? Because the idea of being yourself simply suggests there is little to no need for change. And when we get comfortable with that idea, we become lazy and rarely want to get out from it. We further solidify that position by telling ourselves how unappreciative people can be, how boring that date was anyway, or just simply concluding that going on dates is a waste of time. I have this friend who always tells me, if a guy likes her, he should like her for who she truly is. And if she's expected to change to what people want of her, then she's not being true to herself or to anybody. In other words, she considers herself fake. Now, how many of you actually have this thought process over and over again? Don't get me wrong, I'm not telling you to be somebody else. What I'm simply saying is, always be a more attractive version of yourself. And not just in terms of physical appearance, but more towards how you engage people and the vibes you give out. So, for example, you could share your personal experience instead of waiting for people to ask about you or smile more when you're speaking or simply just showing more interest in the things people are talking about. And if doing those things make you a little uncomfortable, it's perfectly fine. It just shows that you seldom do them. For myself, I used to hate smiling a lot and I always tell myself I need a reason to put a smile on my face. As I grow up getting used to that idea, most of the people around me would tell me I have this arrogant, unapproachable image Tew! which really puts people off. But once they get to know me as a person, they realize I'm really goofy and crazy sometimes. <laughs> but in a likable way, of course. Once I start to put some effort into meeting people with a smile, the feedback I received gradually became more positive. And this is only possible when I stop being myself, or rather my old self, and start doing something different even though it feels really awkward at the start. So, go out there today and become a more attractive version of yourself. If there is anything stopping you from doing that, it's you. Good luck and I'll see you in the next video.